Well, the key decision is over the last uh, week or two, I have been inundated in my mailbox from members of the party who, all over the country who said, Stephen, we want to see you in a key role in Diane's, uh, uh, Diane's uh, kind of government, in a sense. And of course, it's not a government, but in terms of her leadership team. And of course, now they've stepped aside, they're all now doing exactly the same again, saying, please stand. I've always believed that we should have a country, in a word, almost like, as I said, uh, Theresa May taking our lines, a country that should be fit for everybody, where anybody born in this country, irrespective of who you are, has the opportunity to grow and expand and live free, fruitful lives. And on the back of that, you need to have a strong health service that is well-funded. You need to have an education system that is capable of bringing the best out of everybody, hence my support for grammar schools. That you have a government that recognises the imposition of large-scale migration pushing down wages and enable training so that people can get the jobs, so that you don't have people who are disabled, elderly, left behind, and that you give entrepreneurs and small businesses that great opportunity to build and grow. That is what I mean.